Hi, I'm Gary Young. Uh, Lark, my wife, and I have been attending Unity Church since roughly 1980. And uh, here I sit today in this beautiful new stage, which is just recently remodeled. And I think, wow, look how fast time has passed. 1980 to now, 34 years. And I think Lark and I would say that from the very beginning, from the first time that we came to Unity Church, we were moved. Uh, we were kind of captivated by the spirit of positive energy and kind of moving ahead with our lives. And as all, I think, Unity members, we all go through changes of life and different experiences. And Unity Church gave us a, a lot of support at times when we needed it. And also we've had the great opportunity to be around a lot of very great people. Over the years, we uh, served as ushers. And I think one of the great experiences of being an usher is at the nine o'clock service, the early birds, greeting uh, the, the church members. Uh, we have a very diverse, incredible group of high energy people. I like to think of Unity as a church of leaders. And I think their constituents are members of this church. Many of them reach out into the community and make a difference. And I think we come back here and we kind of recharge. And I think thanks to Nancy and Bill and the uh, topics that are selected and the bridges that are made between Christianity and positive thinking, positive growth, and how we can make a difference uh, are continually reinforced. And so I come to Unity to recharge. I come to Unity to have an experience of what being in a holistic supportive environment is. And I think that's uh, seen in the eyes of all of those here every Sunday. Uh, my only regret is we don't get here often enough. I think it's important that we all support this, this church. I think we're very, very fortunate to have a community-minded church that's active in the community right here in a nice Bellevue neighborhood. And I think that can only happen with the continued work, which I feel very fortunate that all of our church members are so active, and also with financial support. And I think it's necessary that we all do the best we can, given our needs and our abilities, uh, to continually support through pledging or whichever ways we go to help the church move on and, and uh, spread the good work. So thanks for letting me share these words on behalf of Lark and myself. We love you and take care.